Uh, today's a really special day, uh, and not just for Sea Life, but for DPI, for UTS, and all of our other partners as well. Our first positive intervention on this endangered species. So the white seahorse are endangered. We've put in a lot of effort and time and resource to breed and raise the babies that we've got so far. And putting them into the wild today is the first point of action for us to really see uh, how, they'll, how they'll fare and, and really be able to track the progress that these animals make over the coming months and years. So today we're going to release about 90 baby seahorses and we're going to release them in two locations. We're going to put half of them on the net and we're going to put half of them on the seahorse hotels. But when we release them, it's going to be very delicate. I want to make sure that the babies go inside the hotels so they can't be eaten by the predators. Because a lot of fish out there would love to eat these seahorses. And same as when we put them on a the net, we're going to make sure they attach to the net and they can hide straight away so they can't be eaten by predators. They've all been individually tagged with um, colour markings so we can see who they are. And now the most important bit is we're going to do a monitoring program to see how well they go in the wild. We want to make sure that this project is successful by seeing these babies regularly and hopefully in a couple of months time we'll see them breeding which is then enhancing the local populations of the white seahorse. This is a really important project for Sea Life Sydney Aquarium because of the conservation element to it. Uh, this is an endangered species and it's given us at the aquarium to, uh, the opportunity to, to work hands-on with them, uh, work hands-on with this uh, you know, amazing local endangered species and be able to have a really positive impact on its future.